Today we are opening up Legendary Collection Kaiba. And since there's only a few packs in those, we've got a bunch more fun stuff to open up too. But let's just dive on into this. I bought it as an unlimited print box, but if you look right there, it looks like it does have that first edition symbol. So this actually might be a first edition that I picked up as an unlimited. And if that's the case, I'm gonna buy some more unlimited ones because they're a little bit less expensive and the first edition does help out a little bit too. So you know we're going for the Ash Blossom. It is an ultra rare in this, so hopefully we'll pick that bad boy up. But we've never opened up Legendary Collection Kaiba before. Super excited about this one. We got three mega packs in the promos. We're gonna jive on into those because we actually never opened this, so we're gonna look at the promos. But let's see, you know we got the game board. It's one of those plastic kind of cardboard ones. Let's see if we can. That's pretty sweet. I like that. That's a pretty cool game board. We'll might replace it with the one that we've got as our background. So let's jump on into those promos. And since there's three packs, we're gonna kind of go back and forth between these three mega packs and then our wonderful booster packs that we picked up from the local store today. We've got Battles of Chaos, Burst of Destiny, and Lightning Overdrive. So super excited about this. Like I said, we're going for Ash or Delinquent Duo. Those are the two really that we want to pull. So there's Goddess of the Sweet Revenge, the King of D, nice little guitars, Destruction Dragon, Dragon Revival, in Loop of Destruction, the Cousin of the Ring of Destruction. So those are the wonderful promos, but let's get into, it is first edition. So that's exciting because it was sold as unlimited. So if, uh, if you're selling these, just double check that little print in the top. I think it's um, two from the front. We'll find out. We got Master with Eyes of Blue. Hey, there's a Blue Eyes White Dragon. Not the artwork that we wanted, but it's a Blue Eyes, so not bad. We got Soul Exchange, Cloning, Giant Red Sea Snake, Mirror Force, all right, Dragon Ravine, and Melody of Awakened Dragon, followed by Traded and White Hole. So not too bad. We got a, we got a Blue Eyes on the first pack. So I'll take that as a win. We're going to set these aside. We'll sleeve those up here in a bit. But let's dump, dump, dive into Burst of Destiny. Hopefully we can get something good. Can we get a Secret Rare out of this? That's what we really need. No, we got the Meow Slick. No Secret Rare on that. Look at this. Battles of Chaos. These were loose packs from the local store, so hopefully we're able to get some good stuff out of it since there's no uh, guaranteed rarities right now. Dino Morphia, hey, we got an ultra rare on the first one. Not too bad, those do look a little bent. They did, when I did buy these, they did drop um, one of the packs from pretty high up when he was picking it up. So I'm assuming it was that pack. All right, Burst of Destiny once again. Sword Soul of Tai. Nothing on that. Let's do a Lightning Overdrive now before we. We might do two more packs and then we're going to jump into that Kaiba collection because there's only three of them. We don't want to burn through them too quickly. AI, amazing rank up. So we're getting a bunch of super rares out of this. Can Battles of Chaos come back with something epic? Because now there's chances to get Secrets, Starlights, and the Dark Magician. We're really going for a Dark Magician um, that we can actually grade. Nordic Smith. And the, the Flower Dino is always in the back of those for me. But I, like I said, we're going for a, a Dark Magician that we can actually grade. We've gotten a couple pulls, but the centering was terrible on them. So hopefully soon, maybe today, we can pick one up. Hey, we got Live Twin. We got our first Ultra Rare out of the wonderful Lightning Overdrive. Come on, Battles of Chaos. I've only got five packs of this today, so hopefully we can get something epic out of this. Leaf Place, Dinomorphia, and Nordic Relic. Nothing out of the, nothing out of those. All right, let's dive on into another Kaiba pack. We'll take two from the front again, put those couple secrets in the back. Can we get the Ash Blossom? Can we get Delinquent Duo? We got the Monarchs, 
Mausoleum of White, Tyrant Wing, Rider of the Stormwinds, Fusion, Sa Fusion Sage, Just Desserts, classic card right there, Chain Disappearance, we got B Buster Drake, Silver's Cry, not bad, and C Crush Wyvern. So, not the Ash Blossom, but we got some pretty decent cards in that one. We got one pack of Kaiba left, and we've got a bunch of loose packs here. So let's just burn through these, and hopefully we can get something good. Garden Rose, not what we're wanting to see. Nope, come on Lightning Overdrive, give us something that's spectacular. Terrors, Springins Brothers, Judgment of Brandon, ooh, and the Rocks Rose Dragon. Not the dragon that we want out of Lightning Overdrive. Hopefully it's still hiding in there, because we've got a couple packs left. But every time I get Burst of Destiny solo packs, I tend to have something good. So hopefully it's not in this pack. Not in that pack. I did once pull a Starlight out of a loose booster pack from the store, so that was a long time ago. Hopefully they got new boxes in, and there's a chance that we got a Starlight in today. Dark, Eye Nightmare, War Rock, Amaze Attraction, and the Lavala X Lord. That's the one tough thing about buying loose packs, is you never know what you were going to get. You could get some epic stuff, or you could get a bunch of supers. Branded in red. We're going to burn through those ones. We got two battles of chaos left, so hopefully we get some last pack magic. Let's just do this real quick, and hopefully we'll get something epic. Dogmatica, Tyrant of Thunder, Dinomorphia, Ghost Trick or Treat, Skilled Brown Magician, Doll Happiness, Neroy the Dream Mirror Trader, <laughs> Ice Shade Creation, and it's a trap, Dinomorphia, not the Dark Magician. Come on, Lightning Overdrive. Let's get something epic. Boo Boo Game, the Daffy, the Nightmare, and S Force Edge Razor. Look at all, look at all the flying dude from the ships. I believe in the heart. Two cards, that's the destiny. Come on, burst. That's, fine. that's not, that's not it. That's not what we want. Alright, we got two more packs. I should break the destiny. Destiny Hero, Phoenix Enforcer has been pulled. That right there takes the cake. I've pulled this one time before and um, we got it again. I'm super soaked on that one. That is a fantastic card. So we're going to sleeve this in the closest sleeve that we've got. And of course, look at the Destiny Hero. That's a beautiful card. What an epic pull. See, like I said, Burst of Destiny always treats me right when I buy. Sorry, I didn't notice it. Always treats me right when I get a lose pack out of the local store. So, if we can, if we top that today, I'll be surprised. Arubashi, Book of Lunar Escape, at Eclipse. Sorry. Hey, we got ourselves another secret rare out of a loose pack. So that's not too bad. I mean, we had a total of. 19 loose packs and two secret rares and that is not bad at all. That's uh, definitely above the ratio for a box. We'll save that Battles of Chaos for a little next and go into our last Burst of Destiny. Can we top the Phoenix Enforcer? Magical Cylinders and we cannot with this last pack. But we got one more pack before we jump on into our last first edition. Legendary Collection Kaiba. Alright, let's take three. Then the front, keep that guy back there. Smoke Mosquito, Mad Hacker, Doll Monster, Dinomorphia, 
Silvermine, Doll Monster Bear Bear, Sword Soul Strife, Dino Morphia Domain, third secret rare out of the opening. That's that's better than the ratio. Perfect. So that's still a pretty decent card. And we got the Phoenix Enforcer and the Lunar. Let's take a look real quick at that Phoenix Enforcer one more time before we hop on into our Legendary Collection Kaiba. That looks to be fairly well, maybe a little bit off to the, from a little bit more on the left, but let's take a look at the back. Not bad at all. Beautiful, beautiful card. All right, enough of the Destiny Hero. Let's get into our last Mega Pack for all the marbles, first edition. Do a legendary collection Kaiba for all of the marbles. Take those front two. See if we can get Ash Blossom. We got Full Force Virus, Vampire Lord, Tyrant Wing once again, Thunder Dragon, Judgment, uh, epic, epic nostalgic card right there. Rider of the Storm, Enemy Controller, another epic Kaiba, Beacon of White, Neutron Blast, and number S39, Utopia the Lightning. So, we didn't get the Ash Blossom. We did get a Blue Eyes, though. And we got the Phoenix Enforcer out of Burst of Destiny. So that's an epic opening. Hopefully you're all liking the content. If you do, feel free to subscribe. Hit a like, comment down. Just say what's up at this point. Super happy to have you all here. Thank you all for the continued support. I need to work on my speech. But until then, I'll catch you in the next one.